Today's video is short and sweet. I'm gonna to introduce to you a way to make large artwork on walls or fabric, even if you don't know how to draw. How many times have you seen a large painting or a large drawing on a wall and wish that you could do that yourself? You can. I am going to introduce you to something today that just might blow your mind. I found an app that you can load onto your smartphone called Mural Maker. And I downloaded that app and all you need is two smart devices in order to draw a large image that you can then paint and personalize either a photo backdrop or a video backdrop or something for a party or even a mural on a wall. So I actually uploaded a high, local high school here. It's the school that my daughter goes to, their logo, which is WC for Winston Churchill, a large cheerleader silhouette, a large megaphone, and even the word future and the word cheerleader. And I projected them. It's not even projection. It's not. It's like a mirror image thing that's happening. I've used projectors in the past for my murals, but this is different. You don't need a projector. You just need two smart devices that work together. And then I drew them out. That's what you saw me doing in high speed. Uh, I drew them out with a pencil onto this backdrop. And then once the pencil drawing was done, I went back with a Sharpie marker and just traced out my image that set my image in place um, with the Sharpie marker. Now, the thing that I'm actually drawing on right now is this, uh, I think it's actually a room divider, but I ordered it off of Amazon. I think it was like $50. It comes with the stand. And this was going to serve as a backdrop at a cheerleader camp for young girls at my daughter's high school. Um, so this was the perfect setup. I was a little nervous if I'd be able to paint this fabric. I wasn't sure exactly what type of fabric this would be but it was very paintable and it actually feels just like a shower curtain. So I wasn't real sure, but with a small test spot, I realized that I could paint my image on it. So once it was all drawn, drawn with my Sharpie marker, I took it off of the frame and laid it down on the ground and I just started painting. It was a little weird at first. You can see that the I'm, I'm used to painting really quickly, but this needed me to slow my paint stroke down because the the fabric is actually water repellent um, and you can see here as I move my brush across it that I have to really lay down quite a bit of paint and then move in a slow motion and that is all I had to do that's the only adjustment that I had to make to my painting I just used small craft brushes and you can see there how I'm having to go slowly and it really soaks in finely but if I went quickly it just sort of made this light black mark across the top. So I just slowed myself down and enjoyed the process. So I feel like today's video really gives you a couple of really valuable things. And that is one, this room divider that comes with a stand that was easy to install. I was able to put it together on location. It does not require a, not even one tool. They just, it's a snap lock system. So me and the cheerleader girls just put it together ourselves. And to think that you could personalize this for baby showers or birthday parties um, and look like an artist. <laughs> when you don't even know how to draw and all you do is download this app I, this is not a paid promotion this is just something that i found called mural maker and you just download the app and put the image wherever you want i i downloaded these separately like the girl from the megaphone and the words they were all done separately and i just put them wherever I wanted them on the sheet itself. So there you go. That's what it looks like. Isn't it just adorable? Not a bad investment for $50 and I learned something new and I hope that I will see you out there now creating large backdrops and really cool, fun and funky murals on walls. And that's it. Like I said, short and sweet. Be sure to like and subscribe and I'll see you next Sunday with another video.